Hello traders, welcome back to Pips Traders YouTube channel. Thank you for your continued support to my channel. I really appreciate your support. So today in this video, as usual, we are going to be doing daily technical analysis in gold, US dollar, currency pairs. Let us look at the current trend of the price action and mark the present support and resistance levels for today. And when we look at the economical events plan for today, today is Tuesday, November 22nd. At 12.30 p.m. we have high impact news plan for Australian dollar related currency pairs. And at 7 p.m. we have medium impact news plan for Canadian dollar related currency pairs. Then at 8.30 p.m. we have medium impact news plan for US dollar related currency pairs. So we don't have any high impact news plan for any of the major currency pairs. Let us begin our gold analysis. I mean daily time frame now and we know from the past price action that previously it was trading below this resistance line on a bearish strength after taking support on the support level of 1617 we have noticed it to bounce back on the bullish side retracement and on the retracement also it did not break the previous high of 1800 which means that this level of 1800 is going to be acting as a very strong resistance level when the price action tries to continue with its bullish side retracement. And as long as the price action is trading below this resistance level of 1800, it is still in a bearish trend, moving on a sideways price action. And when we look at the current price action where we have noticed a price action to bounce back on the bullish side retracement. And currently we are noticing it to again trend on the bearish side. So when we consider only this part, this bearish trend is only a retracement. It is not a trend reversal for now in daily time frame. So when we look at the resistance and support levels using the Fibonacci tool, we are seeing next level of support to be around 1723 or 1725. And only when the price action breaks this support level, we can expect it to take support on the next level of support of 1700. And if the price action breaks this support level of 1700, next level of support is going to be around 1682 or 1680. And next level of support is going to be around 1670, 1657, 1642 and 1617. And on the bullish side, only when the price action breaks the resistance level of 1752, it will be a bounce back on the bullish side retracement. And next level of resistance is going to be around 1789. Next level of resistance is going to be around 1800. So this zone between 1800 to 1790 is going to be acting as a very strong resistance zone are now in daily time frame on the bullish side and this level of 1723 is acting as a neck level of the double bottom pattern for now so it has to break this neck level if the price action needs to trend further on the bearish side retracement let us look at the price action in four hours time frame i'm in four hours time frame now as explained in the yesterday's analysis, the current price action is trying to form a head and shoulder pattern and it has already completed its right hand shoulder and we can expect it to trend further and to take support around the support level of 1700. And once the price action breaks this support level, next level of support is going to be around 1682 or 1680 and it will be also completing its head and shoulder pattern but the current support is around the level of 1723 so wait for the so wait for the price action to break this support level of 1723 if you want to still continue trading on the bearish side retracement let us look at the price action in hourly time frame i'm in hourly time frame now when we look at the price action in hourly time frame i'm again going to draw a resistance line or a trend line to understand the current trend of the price action for hourly time frame. So based on this trend line, we can clearly understand that 
the current trend of the price action is in a bearish trend and next level of support is going to be around 1723 from the higher time frame and only when the price action breaks the higher time frame support level of 1723 we can expect the further continuation of the bearish side trend in hourly time frame also and if you want to start taking trades on the bullish side retracement wait for the price action to break this higher time frame resistance level of 1753 based on which you can continue trading on a bullish side retracement and it will also be breaking the hourly time frame trend line or the resistance line which is the confirmation on the start of the bullish side retracement let us mark the support and resistance levels so the values within this green color boxes are the resistance and support levels for current price action in hourly time frame currently the price action has taken support on the support level of 1733 and it is on a bullish side retracement and next level of resistance on the bullish side is going to be around 1743 and only when the price action breaks this resistance level of 1743 we can expect it to retest on the trend line or resistance line from the hourly time frame and once the price action breaks this resistance line next level of resistance is going to be around 1751 1754 1757 1761 and 1768 and on the bearish side if the price action breaks a support level of 1733 next level of support is going to be around 1723 and the current trend of the price action is still in a bearish trend as long as it is trading below this trend line of the hourly time frame let us look at the price action in 30 minutes time frame i am in 30 minutes time frame and in 30 minutes time frame also i am again drawing a support line or a trend line and we can clearly notice that the current trend of the price action is still in a bearish trend and it is also forming a widening wedge which gives a confirmation that bearish trend is still continuing so the values within this green color boxes are the resistance levels and the support levels currently the price action is trading between the resistance level of 1739 and support level of 1733 wait for the price action to break the support level of 1733 and next level of support from the higher time frame is going to be around 1723 and only when the price action breaks the support level we can expect a further continuation of the bearish strength in 30 minutes time frame also and on the bullish side if the price action break the resistance level of 1739 next level of resistance it's going to be around 1740 1749 1752 1756 1765 and if you want to understand the trend more clearly i would recommend you to again draw a resistance line for 30 minutes time frame so once the price action breaks this trend line or resistance line from the 30 minutes time frame you can take trades on the bullish side retracement but please note that as long as the price action is trading below this hourly time frame resistance line the current trend of the price action is still in a bearish trend but once the price action breaks the higher time frame resistance level of 1752 it is the confirmation on the start of the bullish side retracement in 30 minutes time frame So that's all the analysis for today. Thank you for watching this video. If you have found this video to be useful, press that like button and share this video with your friends.